Where's the client's eyebrow to? Master? Bob, I'm a little busy right now. Give me a sec. Wait, that's your master? Yep, he's Master Reagan, a powerful psychic. You can't be serious. What do you mean? I don't feel any spiritual power coming from this guy at all. That idiot Shigeo is totally getting used by him. I could let him know, but... Nah, this is fine. I'm sure I'll find a way to make use of this knucklehead, too. There we go, all done. Master, I've had this spirit stuck to me since this morning. What do you think I should do with it? Maybe erase it, or...? Huh? Uh... Huh. <laughs> you won't be able to see me, you fake. Must be too weak for me to see it. What?! To put it in perspective, it'd be about the same as a ladybug on your shoulder. Do whatever you want. Lucky you. Now don't cause any harm and I won't erase you. <clears throat> the hell is that? Dimple! I was finally able to get out! <laughs> Alright! Now that I've consumed those spirits and regained some of my strength, I can help here! It's already done. Huh? You mean the climax happened without me? Is this an evil spirit? Whoa! How is it that you're able to see me when I'm not in my visible mode? They're really strong. No. Oh, hey. So, what brings you here? I'm only here because Shigeo asked me to come. He passed out and can't help with exorcising spirits. Now that I think about it, do you even need Shigeo anymore? You awakened your psychic powers, right? Don't be stupid. Everything you saw was Mob's powers. The only thing I gained from it is the ability to see you now. Otherwise, nothing's changed at all. Back to a plain old con artist, huh? You're a rather rude spirit, aren't you? Okay, then come along and help me out. The name was Dimple, wasn't it? Huh? You're kidding me! Why do I have to help you? Isn't that the reason he had you come over to begin with? If he just wanted to say hi, he could have simply called me up. What? You can't be serious. Who do you guys think I am? Well, unless I'm mistaken, you're Mob's errand boy. I'm a high-level evil spirit! TV or something. He's been at this book thing for quite a while now. That guy tricked your brother again, didn't he? Anyway, considering how much work you've been putting into that thing, you'd better make sure you get paid, Shigeo! Master said he'd give me my usual hourly pay, plus 0.2% of all the book sales. That's even less than sales tax. Though I can't say I'm surprised. This unknown psychic. Scream's bestseller, right? Yeah. Uh, it looks shady as hell. Come on, what would a green blob like you know about books anyway? Guess I better check it out, just to be- WHAT'S GOING ON HERE?! I'm really sorry, Master. Everybody told me this would be a better approach. Run! It's a totally crappy approach! I'm on the cover, and now I look like a complete embarrassment! Wow, learn how to take a little criticism, will ya? Oh, sir. It's fine. Start handing these out. Hmm? What is this? Our trip itinerary. It seems like you're the excited one. This kind of feels like we're all going on a school trip together. Right, brother? Yeah, it sure does. Man, those days were the best. That really takes me back. Playing some cards, having pillow fights, tests of courage. How about I set up our very own test of courage? Come on, give me a break. We're not in grade school anymore. I wanted to thank Reagan. I guess he was working really late last night. Yeah, right. Bet he was making those guides. Uh... Well, you know, I was trying to get to the bottom of all this and lost track of time. Right. You probably went nuts though, because you couldn't get out. That's it. Hold on. A ward in her nose? Bingo. The family of matrons who run this place have worshipped Ibogami for generations. Without realizing it, they developed psychic powers, and that power was sealing up the entrance to the parallel world. So that psychic roadblock was weakened because she caught a cold? Exactly. With the psychic seal broken, the entrance to the other world cracked open, and if you fell asleep inside the Ibogami tunnel, phew, you got sucked in. Well, that's wackadoodle. These different types of psychic powers are always going to be a mystery to me. We all got to relax. What? Party poopers, what's your problem? You know what, forget it, I was kidding anyway. It didn't look like you were kidding when you rolled up your sleeve. Shut up and go to bed, okay? Okay, good night. Anyway. Hey, Mob. Is Dimple around? Dimple, he's calling you. What now? 
I stay in extra invisible mode just to avoid you. Aw, oh, come on, don't be like that. We're co-workers now, aren't we? Like hell we are! You just boss me around like I'm Keep a close eye on the fatso we're working with. Use your stealth mode. Well, what's the point in that? If he skips out on the job, who cares? I think he's the kind of idiot who never deviates from the manual. But on this job, if anything bad should happen to him, as team leader, it'd be on me. Come on, Dimple, please. Help us avoid any accidents. Okay, I'll do it. It's give and take, though. Someday I'll need a favor from you two, and you'd better deliver, you got it? You sensing anything, Mob? Yeah. We're doomed. You're, You're kidding, kidding me! me! Oh, crap, oh crap, oh crap, 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 crap! What do we do? The only thing we can do, run for it! Oh, what happens if he catches us? <laughs> It's said that she grabs her victims from behind and strangles them to death! Boom! Did it! Take a look, Mob. This update will get us four jobs for sure. Hmm? What is this crap? Looks like GeoCities. That is weird. Dimple, are you here? Yeah, what's up? Go take a look outside at this window. See if there are any rope marks on the roof, too. Why am I helping you again? If you see any evil spirits, eat them, alright? Hey, Mob, are you feeling anything? Yes. It's a small presence, but... <laughs> Nothing. I don't see a damn thing out here. Hey, don't shut the window on me, you jerk! But everything she's describing sounds exactly like a stalker. Why would a ghost be interested in a living woman? You got any insight on this? No, not really. It's pretty uncommon for spirits to have any sexual desire. We couldn't reproduce if we wanted to. Is sexual desire always a part of love, though? I, I really don't want to talk about this with you. Yeah, well, that makes two of us, you freak. So they refuse to pay, and they're leaving us out here? That's just perfect. So what now? Guess we'll have to get back to the road and try calling a taxi. No sober for us. What's the holdup here? Give me a minute, all right? Say something, Mob. He doesn't want to do this so badly that he's shaking. No kidding. Okay, got it. We'll leave them alone. I'm not ordering you to do anything, all right? Everything is fine. I trust your feelings on this. Me too. Take it easy. You can finally relax. You've got a strong heart, Shigeo. You don't understand. Hmm? I'm sure. Uh, okay. <sighs> Reagan, so what's gotten into you? Uh, so that's it. How did I not notice? He can do things that other people can't. You sure about how you handled that? You just threw fistfuls of salt around everywhere, said that was it, and took their money. What else was I supposed to do? If I didn't take their money, then they'd be suspicious. Anyway, you confirmed they weren't evil spirits, right? Yeah. I tried to talk them into turning evil, but they weren't having it. What's with the shaking? Ooh. You're yawning? Man, you're a piece of work. Huh? Hey, it looks like there's something on your back. What? Oh yeah, somebody definitely cursed you. What happens if I ignore it? If you let it go unchecked, who knows? You might slip on a banana peel or something. That could prove fatal if I was on the stairs. Get rid of it. No, sorry, I don't think I like your attitude. Come on, I can't ask Mom to do it. That client from yesterday probably hired someone who could really do the job. Fine, whatever. There are things he may know about that we can't see. Really scary things the rest of the world may never come face to face with. But it's nothing like that. What's wrong, Dimple? You're shaking like crazy. Is he a chihuahua? There's still time. Come on, let's just get out of here. Huh? Huh? Listen, this name has to at least ring a bell for you. Keiji Mogami. Never heard of him. Mogami? Yeah, I modeled part of my work off him when I started this job. But he's been dead for some time. Forty years ago, to be precise about it. Look, Dimple. I need a favor. Can you possess my body and protect it for a while? Huh? Oh no, that's not a very good idea, Mob. Knowing him, he'll keep it. Forever. You know what it is you're asking me to do, don't you? <laughs> you're not seriously gonna trust him, are you? I'm sure it'll be fine. First, I need to lose consciousness. No, oh, make a run for it! Call an ambulance! You're not staying here. Shigeo's done for. You gotta accept that. 
Why not run away? Because I still have faith in him. In this situation? You're not really that stupid, are you? Yep. Actually, I am. Let me guess. This is the first time someone's placed so much trust in you, too, right? Uh, uh... Mob only trusts us because he's stupid. See how that works? I've still got plenty of use for him. And considering that, running away is the last thing I want to do. <laughs> <sighs> well, I can't bring out Shigeo's latent powers on my own. And since that's not going to change, it'd be more effective to manipulate him from the shadows. Okay, I've changed my mind. I'm staying behind as well. Good. Let's wait this out. Oh no. Waiting's not going to bring him back. Guess I'll have to find a way to take care of this one myself. <laughs> no way! It looks like he's genuinely having fun! Mob actually has friends! Why in the hell are you hiding, dumbass? <laughs> a dimple! What? I'm not hiding at all. There's no need to worry about Mob. He's having fun. Well, that's great news, but he never even crossed my mind. It's really good to hear that. Shigeo doesn't seem to be concerned about you or what you're doing in the slightest. It's been kind of peaceful. What? Huh. And you're okay with this dimple? What do you mean? The more he avoids me, the less he'll have the opportunity to use his powers. Do you really want to be an ordinary middle schooler's pet forever? Never being more than what you are right now? That would be kind of peaceful. <laughs> I always thought you wanted to use Mob's powers for yourself. Sucks to be you. Now that he's decided to lead such an ordinary life, he's of no use to anyone! Oh, the humanity! I hope you have fun following around a regular old snot-nosed middle schooler! I, on the other hand, will be taking my career on up to the next level. Yeah, sure. Well, I'm glad to see that you're doing all right. If you can crack jokes and be this happy, there's no need to worry. Who knows? We may never see each other again. Shut up! I haven't been running that much myself lately. I can hear you run! Hey, Mom, you want to stop for some tea? We've only been going for about ten minutes, Master. Huh? Brother? Yo! Hey, you've only got about a kilometer to go. Move those legs! Hey, Reagan, nice outfit there, buddy. Shut it. I thought I'd show up, step in, and help him keep his pace towards the end of the run. The group of guys up front are way too fast. They're so far ahead. I'm not sure you'd catch up even if you sprinted. I've been counting the runners. He's currently in 74th place. And I am really proud of him for doing that well. But for him to finish in the top 10, he has to pass 64 others. That's a problem. Should we get a taxi? I mean, the thought did cross my mind, but... Don't be ridiculous. Look at that face. See? He hasn't given up yet. My home is... my family. Sit down. Talk to me. Let him rest. I can fill you in on everything that happened. I see. Dimple. A uh, word, please? Sure. Did you just freak out and lie about the dummies? Kinda, but I do have reasons to believe it. Man, you must have really been panicking. If Mob finds out you lied, he's gonna hate you forever. Hey, Mob, we need to talk. Hang on! Are you gonna tell him? Cause if he finds out the truth, then he might... Mob, about what Dimple said... I think your family is safe, too. Those Esper guys were still on their way to your house, right? Someone must have found out they were in danger and rushed over to save them. They started the fire and made them look dead so they wouldn't be targeted anymore. Isn't that great? The moment he relaxed, he fell fast asleep. Now it's your turn to tell me what's going on. What the hell brought this group together anyway? Aren't these guys from Claw? We're all Dance against them, we need to make sure we have a good leader. Smart choice. And naturally, that led them to my door. Shut up! It's better that way. With Mr. Reagan, the exact qualities we're looking for. Are they serious? Talk about misguided. Wait, didn't Claw come after you too? Yeah, my office was destroyed. Fortunately for me, I just happened to... Is this really the best place for you to be? What the hell could I do out there? 
Besides, when Mob wakes up, it'll probably help if he has someone familiar here to explain the situation to him. But damn, is that kid knocked out or what? He's sleeping like he's half dead. I think this goes way beyond just being tired. Mr. Reagan, there's trouble! Oh, were you guys shaking in your boots yet? Get your asses out here! What's the plan, Reagan? Want me to possess you so you can brawl with him? I'll open the door. He's strong, but thankfully he's also an idiot. I can't believe this ridiculous lucky streak you're on lately. You're gonna die a horrible death. What do we do now? They found our hideout! First, we'll grab a taxi and get out of here. <laughs> what the hell? I thought you were out cold! I was, but too bad for you, because I'm wide awake now, dumbass! Oh, that's awesome! Look, I seriously give up this time. I'm a lover, not a fighter. Idiot! Run for it, Reagan! <laughs> oh, crap, Bob! Psycho steroid! I send psychic signals to my muscles and adjust them for maximum... Yeah, sure, whatever. Go back to sleep. I think that really pissed him off. All right, now he's even more powered up! Enough of this! I'm gonna lure him out! He's not coming? Mom, wake up! Damn, this isn't good! Catch him, Reagan! Right. I was on the boys' volleyball team for about five minutes. Bring it! No devil! Is... is Mom's body okay? That was close, but I think he'll be fine. Somewhere safe and sound, too. Thank goodness. It's just like Dimple and Master said. That was one hell of a scare, huh? Ah, shut up. Tough on people. So that's how Shigeo interpreted what Mogami told him. Dimple, stay with him. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's his ability to tell people exactly how he feels. And that speaks to their heart far more than anything else could. By expressing those feelings, Mob's honest nature helps others... Uh... It's Dimple! What's wrong? Are you okay? Where's Mob? I don't know, but things are looking pretty bad here. That boss guy seemed hell-bent on killing Shigeo. Four Eyes, you got a sec? Huh? Oh, no. What was your last job? Uh, if people showed up, my orders were to... Start attacking them with my umbrella? What the hell, dude? Ah, well, we can make it work. Yo, seems like you're doing well. Been a while, hasn't it, Shigeo? <gasps> Shigeo! If I had to guess, you must have been harboring a strong desire to see me again. Strong enough to prevent me from being totally destroyed. And then I was drawn into this power spiral, which is how I was able to come back. Hey, partner. I think we might want to hear what Reagan's got to say. It was a lucky break that I happened to run into Dimple. That's how I made it to you in time. Hey! How about cutting the chit-chat short there, buddy? Right now, it's taking everything I've got just to keep existing. Yeah, that's pretty much the impression I was getting. Hey, Dimple. Thanks for saving me and everything, but could you give us a minute? What? How are you going to handle him by yourself? <laughs> Fine, then. No fighting, though, you hear? <laughs> Dimple, hmm? let him do this on his own. Okay, but... You think Sabomi's really waiting for him? We don't need to know that. Only he does. <laughs> so, Reagan, what'll you do with yourself now? Beats me. What about you? Your color's looking a bit faded. Hey, he's back already. I guess she left. Who can blame her for that? Rejected. What? You're telling me she was still waiting? <laughs> Man, am I wiped. Yokai, my ass. More like some old creeper with a butt chin. Still, they wanted an exorcism, so I threw a little salt. 
And how is that any different from what you normally do? Hmm? Why are the lights off? Hey, Tomei, Serizawa, are you two in here? Anybody home? Master Reagan. Mom. Well, blow out the candles. Say, your eyes are looking kind of red there. I don't remember asking you, Temple! Huh? You're not gonna cry, are you, Reagan? We were this close to seeing him cry. There's a client on the way here right now! Really? I know that. Now listen up! You all better be prepared to help! 